a Lincoln institution for nearly 100 years, now considered a total loss. Fire inspectors say the building will likely have to be torn down. In the heart of the capital city, heartbreaking destruction. Uh, easily 20, 30 foot flames coming out of the roof. That was a little surreal. Never really seen anything like that before. Fire in Gulf's Ideal Grocery early Thursday morning, four years short of the business's 100th birthday. A lot of the, the clientele and the people who are coming in there were people who were repeat customers for like lots, lots of years, like a long time. People like Shirley Hewerts driving by to say farewell to the store she's been loyal to for 59 years. The place where she's known by her first name. When I had my first child, they sent me flowers in the hospital. A man named Gardner Moore founded Ideal back in 1920. His grandson also coming by the scene to see the damage for himself. Oh, it was a pretty devastating fire, so that's hard. Mark Moore says historic photos posted on the walls inside didn't survive the blaze. Pictures of when the for store first started. Um, a group picture of all the men in, in their white shirts and ties. Moore hopes customers and employees continue to pass memories from those years to future generations. So now they're going to have to find somewhere else to go, and I don't think they're going to find what you know we gave them at Ideal. While the loss deals a big blow to this community, employees here will hopefully get to keep their jobs. Owners tell me they're working on moving positions to one of their other stores. In Lincoln, Camilla Ortiz, KETV News Watch 7.